Oh, hi, hello, everyone. Have a wonderful day again today. And this is Mommy Jinky. And today, I'll show you again another recipe. So, welcome back again to my channel and welcome back to my kitchen. Today, I'll be showing you how to cook rellenong bangus or milkfish. So, let me show you the ingredients that I have prepared. Well, de definitely, I have here my bangus, which I already, you know, deboned, I would say. <laughs> yeah. All the inside part is already removed. So, this is only now the skin of the milkfish. And I have here now our milkfish. It's already boiled and deboned already. I have here an egg. All right, so here's my egg. Well, of course, I have your flour. I have here green peas. And of course, raisins. I have tomatoes. Oh, I'm sorry. That's not a tomato. That's a potato. And here is my carrots. And here are my spices. Well, of course, my celery, basic ingredient, garlic, and onions. So, there we go. So, you have seen all of my ingredients for today. Now, let me show you how to do this step by step. So, just watch this video until the end. And, by the way, if you haven't subscribed yet, please go ahead and click the subscribe button. So, you'll be notified also with our next upcoming videos. I'll be posting more recipes and other videos. So, let's cook this now. Alright, so... Well, of course, the first step is to stir fry first our spices. So let's just add some oil. So let's just heat that for a little bit. Alright, so let's put in our ginger. Oh, sorry. That's not ginger, that's garlic. is already boiled so it's already cooked so we don't want the fish to be overcooked otherwise it's going to be very dry potatoes in Additional aroma, I added some celery stalks. So this will add more flavor to our Rilliano Bamboo.
get a very, very good spear. So you see, making rileno is actually very tedious, but I assure you, once this is all done, you will really love this and enjoy this much. Mm, I can already smell a very good aroma in here. Okay, so this time, let's fill now our bamboo's skin. It's filling there. Oh. Push that all the way down to the tail. There you go. See that? Hello, boy. Hello. Nakapitipan ka. All right. So our first bag mousse is already stuffed. Now, I added a barbecue stick just for it to hold so that when I fry this or when I bake my bamboos, it will not fall off. So, there you go. Oh, there's, I need more filling to that. Yeah, so let's make it really fat. There you go. See, this is really very tedious. And later on, I'm going to sew this so that it will not come out. Everything won't come out, but there you go. See, that's beautiful. Let's do the other one. Look at this. Now, I'm done filling all this bamboos. So this time, actually, what I will do is... I will not fry it, okay? So this is going to be a better and a healthier way of cooking your brilliant. Really, I am going to bake this. So now that it's clean, I am going to brush now some oil on my bamboos. Then I will just bake this in the oven for each side about 10 to 15 minutes for each side. You will see the result. You will love the result of this. Mm -hmm. So we're done. 
brushing some oil on our fish. Now let's bake this in the oven. Time not to put it in the oven. There you go. Wow, look at this. So my real yano is now done. Yeah. It really smells so good. But since it's still very hot, we will have to cool this down. Then, we will start eating and enjoying our real yenong bangus. So, if you enjoy this video, just go ahead and click the subscribe button. Click the notification bell as well. So, you'll be notified of our next videos. And, you can also write down your comments there. And I would be very happy to respond to your comments. Thank you and have a wonderful day. Goodbye for now.